like, like, it's pretty simple. It's like Marth wants to get in, Link wants to keep him out. Right. Link or Marth doesn't want that to happen. Right. The problem, the problem wow. with like, in my opinion, it's like at least like Sizzle's frame of mind is like he needs to go in, but like Marth is just generally considered a very defensive character. Uh huh. Like it's like something like that. I tell him like hit him, but like he's at low percentage, so he's just gonna crouch catch the the forward, the forward smash. Yeah. Um, but at the same time, it's like. I don't know. I feel like it's really hard to get a like a throw follow up on a link. Um, like see, like fairs like gives you like the perfect like combo height. Like it hits, it sends you up and like you can you can put the, you can send the link link anywhere after a fair. But like exactly. And see, like right there, that's a like, good punish. You have to do like the down throw tech chases. Right. Well, that's what I was asking if it was real. Like at least for melee, I don't know if it's different in PM. I don't think it is, but. Um, no, it's like, it's pretty close to the same thing. Um, Mark generally doesn't do it, because most characters he can juggle with up throw. You don't see it in melee, because there's fewer matchups where he needs to tech chase. But this right. is one of them. Well, yeah, that's what I'm saying. Like, it's like, oh, matchup, nice. matchup between um, Falcon is the same way, where you want to tech chase the, yeah. tech chase the character into, like, a different guard position. Right. Because, like, Mart's tech chase, like, it's good, but it doesn't do very much damage. Right. Like, you'll see his throws stale to 4%. Yeah. And so it's not like Sheik where you just keep grabbing them. Exactly. Like you said, you want to get that edge guard. Oh, yeah. That was uh, a mess up that turned into a decent situation. Missed the. It's a tech. Yeah. yeah was... I. <laughs> Normally, like, it doesn't matter. Like, that's guaranteed. But Thor yeah. messed up a little. Right. I mean, because Thor usually just reacts to the... He get, he can react to the tech with down throw, or at least just, or down air, just, like, predicted. Uh-huh. There he predicted, uh... I think tech in place would have been caught, maybe, too, as well, because he comes up so fast. Yeah. Um, but... Because normally, like, the down air connects before you can even tech. Right. I don't know. I just feel like, uh... So my game being a little like frustrated with getting hit all, all these projectiles. Like, I don't know. His spacing on grabs and the aerials has been kind of off lately. Yeah, he hits a single hit in there because he passed well too. Yeah. This game won us four. Yeah, Thor was Thor was cooking that game. Yeah, he was playing really. Good. He was cooking some right of the street variety. He's sizzling up some bacon. He's sizzling up some bacon. Oh. Kill me now. <laughs> okay. I'm playing too. Uh, um, next game. <laughs> all right. Um. I don't know. Mm, I'm kinda, stage. You're right, and like, uh, it might have just been because like, like Pokemon Stadium Two is bigger than that. Right? I'm not. I'm not wrong, right? Yeah, the stage right. like it's a lot smaller. So I mean, it could be that like this way, uh, projectiles are a little bit less like like cumbersome because like Thor doesn't have as much room to go through. Uh huh. Um. I don't know. I I still like been debating whether or not platforms are better for the Marth and the Link. Like that's just something I just don't know. And it's something like that. Like I was just like commenting. Oh, on that stuff. I was commenting it on it uh, in the. Uh, it was pronounced Dia, Dia, or whatever. Yeah, like, Dia. Two Link versus uh versus um Ike. Uh huh. And like he like flew in with a nair after he, like Thor missed a grab and he missed. Like I don't know. Like stuff like that. Just I just feel like there are easier punishes on. Link once he misses a grab because like it shouldn't he shouldn't just get away with like a forward throw and then miss the force smash and like get take like five percent after missing a grab it's like stuff like because it's such a hard commit you know yeah it's, it's exactly what you're saying like you can make Link swing like once you get close to him he's not gonna throw projectiles because that's unsafe because right. you're too close so he's gonna do something like a fair or a nair and you can bait that out and so that's like the strategy. You stay close enough to make him uncomfortable, and then you just make him swing. Yeah, it's just, it's just like, um... It's like Marth, actually, in a certain all, way. All Marths uh, know, like, there's like a... Whether or not they know it, there's like a certain, like, spacing, like a magic Marth spacing for every character, where it's like, all your tippers will connect, and none of other, like, none of the other characters will hit you. Mm -hmm. At least in Melee, that's just the case, because, like, Marth has... The, lo the largest hitbox, like the largest disjointed hitboxes, right? Yeah. It might not be the same in PM, but he's still like his his sword hitbox is super long. Like he has really like longer range than most of the casts. Uh, yeah. Melee, I'll just say the same thing for PM. And, like. Yeah, it's the same. 
for PM for the most part. There's one character that outranges him, but yeah, yeah. In, in general, it's just like you want to abuse that. If you want to abuse the, the fact that it's disjointed, he has such a long range by like finding that magic breath spacing. It's like yeah. I don't know. I feel like it might be he might be frustrated because he doesn't know that spacing for Link. Mm-hmm. And it just it just comes with experience, which is hard to get when Lindor is the only Link player in Champagne. And Sizzle ditched us and hasn't played PM in a while. <laughs> Thor's two. Yes, I will. Off his invincibility. Okay. You did take four, like ten percent. I guess it doesn't matter because you're dead. You're dead to anything. Yeah. So I guess the invincibility is fine. You could just ledge stall him. I don't know. Right. I'm bad at that. Bad at ledge stalling. I think Thor's got this, man. No, I believe. Let's go, Sizzle. Let's go, Sizzle. No bias. <laughs> if anything, it's it's only bias because he's Asian. It's not because he plays Mario. Okay. Right. I'm fine with that. Yeah, yeah, okay. I... <laughs> Good. Good. <laughs> no, I feel that. Okay, so there's a there's another right, thing so you can do is corner pressure. Um, yeah. You get, like, in a corner, he doesn't have many options to get out. There was a fair that he missed earlier that he just got punished by Nair. It's like, I, I don't know, I feel like it's just something like that. It's just, he's just getting hit with these, like... It's just something like that. It's like, I, I think that's good enough. A fourth throw, a fourth smash, but it's still, like, it's not setting him up for anything, like... It's not setting him up to, like, kill the Link, which is generally what you want to do, right? Like... Kill the Link? Yeah, yeah. yeah. That's, that's what you want to do in Smash in general. But, I mean... I don't know. Oh my goodness! At least for me, it's demoralizing when I when he misses a grab and I don't get anything off of it. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Thor knows the DI for that though. Right. Yeah. Ooh, that was tricky, but he got through. Oh wow. Also kind of tricky. Really good counter. I can't believe he got that grab. Yeah. Nice up there. Yeah, that ended up being. Uh, oh, oh such an early up B. I think he's trying to hit get hit by the arrow. I think he didn't want to get arrowed. I think he Were you trying to get hit by the arrow? <laughs> yeah. I don't know. I feel like I feel like it's just like 